my name is Roberto Jolliffe. Um, I'm an entrepreneur. I'm working on a mobile app, uh, also pursuing acting and improv and things of that nature, and also doing some directing and interviewing for a uh, mini doc series that we're developing. Um, I'm ambitious, I'm hungry. I'm always trying to find something to either get into or learn. Um, my day job is really um, IT, so I do like um, mobile development testing or mobile performance testing where I make sure we test apps that are out there and just um, they go through the full onslaught of testing to make sure they're running good, if there's anything that's going on behind the scenes in the network, things of that nature. Um, I love art. I love going to art festivals, museums to look at different period pieces. Um, I love music. I love checking out or learning about new music or seeing it being made or developed. Uh, I love food. Uh, that's kind of a bad thing, but I like trying different styles or different uh, areas or regions of food or food trucks or food festivals just to see what's out there and uh, expand my palate just a little bit. Um, how does it feel when I'm organized versus unorganized um, it, it can feel a little overwhelming at times especially um, in my schedule if I don't have the right things lined up or I have a clutter of certain things I'm like dang I just need to get through this pile or sometimes I have a clutter of work and it you know you might have a, a desk that's full of papers well for me since I'm in the IT field my desk is my computer or computer screens and if there's, I just layer my work on the either individual monitors or um, on the little bar below. So I just have to make sure I'm managing to hit the task and knock those out accordingly. Um, but it can affect me slightly, but I don't let it take too much of effect on my work. I try to just make sure I knock it out and uh, refocus and re-strategize my, my thoughts and knock out the things that need to be knocked out. Um... How do I stay organized in my personal workspace? I really keep a notepad. Um, I have a journal I usually write in or I make sure I'm hitting all my goals either daily, weekly, or monthly, yearly, whatever. Um, however, you, I write it down. But I just try to make sure I hit those goals and I just that keeps me in track of being organized and making sure I'm having either the right documents out or right paperwork or right um, the right meetings and things of that nature. So that's what really keeps me in track with everything. Um, so how important is organization for your business and you as a business owner or professional? <clears throat> I think it's very important because um, there are slight times where you can mess up um, your schedule. If you're not paying attention and you're not organized, you might miss out a meeting, but I don't think that's ever happened to me, but I, I could be a little thrown off if it's a, mu a multitude of uh, meetings, but I think it's just staying on track of everything. I think you have to be on point because um, one thing that you do, somebody can remember for, for forever, and you just have to make sure that you're accountable because uh, you're... you're your body of work is going to be presented to everybody else, and that could be their first impression. You don't know. Um, that could last forever. What is the rule of thumb, word of wisdom, penny of your thought, life advice you would tell us? Um, it's really just to take everything and stride. Learn from everybody. Learn from everything. Some things in life that are not planned, and you just have to go with it and figure it out from that point. And sometimes what you think your vision is is not really what you should be uh, having or it might not be the path you think you should be going on but life is going to take you down that path you might learn something from that you could take that away and it might put you back on track of where you're supposed to be going in your head but I, I just learned that there's always something to learn there's always something to be taken away from um, every situation so don't uh, disregard whatever situation you're in and don't compare yourself to other people some people take 10 years to get great some people take one I mean it's just all how you work and um, right place right time timing meeting the right people so just keep working don't try to compare yourself and focus and follow your dreams and um, don't don't let fear hold you back from going where you need to be and that's um, that's a wrap for this thank you Thank you.